the first break in the grips is very easy, right? So I'm gonna show you here. When Fab is not advancing the position, when he tries, go ahead, Fab, just posture up on his toes over there. This one, okay? Go back there, please. I'm gonna hold the triceps and collar. And look what I'm gonna do with my knees, watch. And go ahead, Fabio. If I just do this, it's not gonna work because my hips is not off the floor, right? I need the leverage. As Fabio tries to push up, look at my hips, watch. Up, and before he tries to like to push up, I bring him down. And look what I'm doing with my upper body, watch. I'm, I'm deflecting on the side, right? Now, as I did that, I reach behind his head, keep out the side, and reach for the belt, lock it up. One more time, watch. As soon as he holds the hold to a triceps and collar, and start to push up, Lift up, watch, and bring him down behind the collar, right behind his head. He pop the side, reach for the belt, and lock it up. That's number one, right? Number two, same scenario, right? Triceps, collar, he posture up. I try one. Fabio think I gave up right in the position, but I didn't. When he tried to step his right leg in base, I'm gonna go whip him hard and once again, watch. This way, right? Now I go exactly the same. The hand goes on the collar, just slide the thumb, holding down, hip out the side, reach for the belt, lock my elbow, and lock it up over there. One more time. So, triceps, collar. I tried the first one, I think I give up, but look at my hip, I'm not getting lazy and relaxed here, no, no. I stay from here, watch, I let him step, as a step, I go again, bring him down, and move to the side of my head, right, and here. You don't need to let it go and re-grab, right? Take advantage from this grip of here. Just slide your thumb. Slide your thumb, watch. Keep him down. Keep out the side. Reach for the belt. Close your elbow. And lock it up on the close guard over here holding the belt. Alright guys, so first thing we're going to do here today, we're going to break the posture, hold the belt, and now so we're going to go try to go for the triangle. And when the person defends, we're going to go for the more. Let's take a look on that, okay? So first thing, I'm gonna hold the triceps, same size, hold the sleeve over here, I'm at my collar. Coach. And then I'm, I'm gonna go for, uh, for the collar over here. When Fabio posture up, what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring my knees together by whipping my knees towards my chest and break his posture, okay? Go back there, Fabio, please. Let's take a look on that watch. When he goes up, I break the posture. As I break the posture, my hand, what, slide, slide there. I'm going to hip out, same size as I hip out. I'm going to exaggerate over here and hold the belt. As I hold the belt, I'm gonna lock my elbow, right? Isolate his arm, and now I'm gonna go for the triangle, right? As soon as I try to go for the triangle here to push his biceps, Fab is doing a really good job by stalling there. He's locked his elbow, and I can do it, right? So from the biceps, I'm going to slide my hand and hold the wrist. And notice here, if I stay this way, it's gonna be hard for me to do the pump sweep. So I'm gonna come up on my elbow, watch. Look at that. As I come up on my elbow, very simple. I'm going to step my left foot on the floor, and now I'm going to bait Fabio, right? I'm going to bump. As I bump, I'm gonna bring him back. But before that, the hand I'm holding the belt, I'm gonna reach on the armpit, right? I'm going to bump as Fabio bring me back. I'm going to loop my arm, and now I'm going to redirect him to the side with my right leg. Okay, let's take a look on that. Watch from here, I was holding the belt, right? I hold behind his slat. I'm going to bump a little bit, and when Fabio push me back, look here, watch. I loop. Push him to the side and look at my leg, watch. I bring my knee to my chest and push him sideways. Now from here is easy, watch. To feed my hand. As I feed my hand, I hold over there with the Kimura grip. Squeeze my knees together. Why? Why do I, I'm doing this? Because if I lock my leg over here, Fabio still can roll right and then I'll lose the position. But when I step my left foot on the floor and also with this one here, I do the bite down, it makes it easier for me to finish. Now I bring his elbow towards my face. Now slowly with the control, I push his arm towards his neck and then I can finish that. Let's take a look one more time. Okay, do exactly the same. I'm gonna break his posture, right? Reaching the belt and then we go for the Akimura there. So first thing, I hold the triceps, collar, lift my hip, break his posture over there, slide the thumb, hip out to the side, reach for the belt, right? As I reach for the belt, lock my elbow. Same hand, watch, right hand, I slide the biceps. I'm trying here to push, but Fabi is stalling there. He's doing a really good job, but it's okay. I keep sliding my hand, hold the wrist, and notice you watch. If I do this way, it's gonna be hard for me to come up. Open your elbow, watch. Open your elbow. Now it's easy for me to come up, right? Now this hand, left hand, I reach next to the triceps, right? Right here be uh, below, right? The armpit. Left foot on the floor, and now I'm gonna really exaggerate there. I bump Fabio. Now I'm gonna bump him that way, and now when Fabio bring me back, I'm gonna loop my, loop my arm, right? Bring money towards my chest, and now I'm gonna redirect Fabio towards my left side. So watch from here, right? I go. 
Bump. That's how I push me back. Watch that loop. Squeeze my knees together over there. Feed the hand. Right? No more monkey grip. Uh, no more uh, C grip. Monkey grip now. Now slowly, right? I'm going to push his hand towards behind his head over there. It's slow. And then Fabio tap there on the Akimura. Alright guys, now we're gonna do exactly the same, right? I'm going to break Fabio's posture from the from the close guard, hold his belt, I'm trying to go for the triangle. Fabio is going to defend over there the triangle and then I have to go for the Akimura, right? So let's take a look on this this position over here. I'm holding the triceps over there, collar, as Fab tries to posture up, I break his posture, hold behind his head over here, right to Keep him down, hip out my left side, reach up as high as I can for the belt, lock it up over there, I'm, I am on my side, lock his arm, and now from here, I'm sliding my right hand out towards the biceps, I'm trying to go for the triangle, but Fabio is doing a really good job here by defending and staying really tight, it's okay, from here, I'm going to keep sliding my hand and hold his wrist, and notice here, watch, if I just come up here this way, it's going to be hard, so I open my elbow a little bit, watch, now it's easy for me to come up on my elbow. Okay, now my left hand reaching his armpit, left foot on the floor. Now I'm gonna bump Fabio that way, right? If he stays there, if he doesn't react, I'll probably get the mount position. But what's gonna happen? Fabio's gonna push me back as I do that, right? And as he does that, what am I gonna do? I'm going to loop the arm, and now so I'm gonna use my leg to redirect Fabio towards my left side, right? So that I can go for the more. Watch this way. I'm going to bump. He pushed me back, look more my arm and leg work at the same time. This way, now I squeeze my legs together, right? Feed my hand, my left hand, with my right monkey grip now. I bring his elbow towards my chest. Now slowly, I'm going to push it, push his wrist towards the back of his head, right? And then five will tap there on the Akimura submission.